Hi again, thanks for your company uh, once again. Today, as we reflect on Proverbs uh, chapter 12, we return to um, a theme that is repeated frequently throughout the whole book of Proverbs. This is clearly a really important uh, overall message that Solomon wants to get across to people who seek to live righteously or live for God. Let me read, uh, first of all, from uh, verse 13, chapter 12, verse 13. Evildoers are trapped by their sinful talk, and so the innocent escape trouble. Verse 14, from the fruit of their lips, people are filled with good things, and the work of their hands begin that brings them reward. But then in verse 17, it says this, an honest witness tells the truth, but a false witness tells lies. And then verse 19, truthful lips endure forever but a lying tongue lasts only a moment. There are many, many other examples. We've talked before about the importance of, of, of being truthful, of speaking truthfully and honourably. And uh, there will be many other occasions as we go on looking through Proverbs for as long as we continue like this, um, where the, the nature of our words and the impact of our words and the honesty of our words is commented and if it's being repeated time and again, well, clearly, again and again, it's something we need to take notice of. Uh, and I make no apology, therefore, for talking about it again, uh, because we may determine or decide on for one particular moment of time that we will be more honourable, more honest in our speaking. Uh, but then it's easy to forget, isn't it, when a day or two later uh, we're in the middle of a heated argument or something we might say something that we later regret. So this is a habit that needs to be um, kind of dwelt upon and worked at all the way through our lives. Some of us can master it, some of us struggle with it much more. Whatever camp you're in or whatever uh, category in between those two extremes doesn't much matter. The message, the fundamental message is the same for all of us. We need to be careful what we say we need to be careful how we say it, and we, be, we need to be careful to mean the things that we say, and to be kind, to be gentle, to be loving in all that we say as well. Let's pray. Father, it's very easy to rattle off words to you um, without them necessarily being the things that we mean in our hearts, but you're a God who knows our hearts. And so, Lord, I pray that as we speak to you, we will be truthful. But I pray too, Lord, that you will help us to carry that truthfulness, um, that godliness, uh, out into our conversations with other people all the time. Help us, Lord, all the time to be truthful. Amen. One of the things that uh, liars find very hard is maintaining the lie. Life's so much easier if we tell the truth. God bless you.